shit in. Oh, well, you're always welcome to my second level. Oh, second, oh, second, oh, second, second. I don't know. Welcome to my new video. Um, yeah, oh, sorry, happy breeding. Oh, I've loaded the past week I was in Scotland for the come up game in Glasgow. Yeah, they were fun. Cold, but fun. Um, so yeah, this is the new video to pick up where we left off in the dungeons. So there's a guard there. He's looking in my general direction. So I just I'm just going to turn them off so I know what I'm doing. What I'm doing. I'm not going to be easy. I'm not going to be easy. Okay, so. Here we go. Let's kill him. One more. Up to him. I'm pretty sure it's going to find me now as well. There's one to do as well. Set up the bow. Yep. If it's lagging, I do do it, so I don't know what to do. Oh, come on, please, 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 Oh, 
Stay calm, Arian. What are you doing here? Same thing as you. Yes, but they imprisoned you. Why? They say I killed Fortest. Shame. I'd hope to do that myself. <laughs> do you know your mother's fate? <coughs> Foltest did her no harm. News you can trust is hard to come by in wartime. I've heard nothing about her. Fortunately, I know how to restore my family's honor. Time to think about saving your life. To me, honor is more important than life. Yeah, What do you plan to do? Not your concern. We must get to the oil store where there's a way out. I'm weak. You must help me. I'll wait here. Return for me once you've cleared the way. Fucking prick! Fuck you, cocksucker! Fuck you up the ass! Motherfucker! I'm gonna fucking kill you, hear me? I'll put you prick off and beat your head in with it! State who's rule a title. What was that? Em you snake! You pig! You goat! Oh no, I'm doing Up the stairs. Sorry about this way. Stuff. It is happening. It's, it's fine where I am, but just in case it isn't. You guys. Second door on the left. That's the oil store. Oh, maybe talk to you guys in another five minutes or so. So I'm just going to turn my mic off. Yeah, see you in a bit. Come with me. There's nothing you can do here. 
I've more to do now than ever before. Alone. I need no one's aid for what I aim to accomplish. Is that your final word? Farewell, Witcher. You didn't have to torch the castle. You were to sneak out, avoid anything resembling a bloodbath. You left me the key to my manacles, not an invisibility cloak. Chris, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. Triss, you put yourself out there. An interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel rule Temeria now, or strive to. But no one save old Natalis can restore true order. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand. Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. Triss. Yes? I'm a bit beat up. Will you look at my wounds? Mm-hmm. Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Prepare to cast off! Clear the lines and all aboard! Lines clear, Captain! Honor's a curious thing. Honor made Arian fight a mismatched battle against the might of Temeria. Facing defeat, Honor told Arian to bow his neck to save his men. But that same honor prevented him from saving himself.
Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known the Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, as water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with a sorceress named Yennefer. Stories of a life stolen from him. Am I boring you? Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special is about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. After this part scene, after this one, I'm gonna just uh, stop this episode there. Sheathe your sword, Elf. I'm here to talk. Bow low. You stand before a head crowned. That of Demavend, King of Edurn, by the grace of the gods. Sovereign of the Pontar Valley, and so on. And you are? A friend to non-humans. I have an offer. Speak quickly and to the point. The Arrakis will soon return, and I'd rather know all before then. I can add several more heads to this one. Each crown. Go on. Fault has to start with. I barely escaped in Edern. I'll need help. Access to your hideouts and maps of your secret trails. And the support of the Scoia'tael. I want no gold and have no interest in a killer's fame. Then why do you wish them dead? It's a long story. Your beast nap is knackered. Time to go. Do we have a deal, Elf? Not the cuts in my trip over the road, but then after that, I'm going to end this episode here. Um, like, share, sub, comment, and all usual good stuff. And uh, I will see you later.
Flotsam should be just beyond the point. We'll take the beach. Who's we? You and me. Reconnaissance. I'm coming too. You should stay behind. We can't be sure of the reception we'll get. Precisely why I won't let you go alone. Someone's got to look after you. <laughs> that time of the month. Oh, 